King Rollo woke up and felt hungry. I think I'll have breakfast in bed today, he said. He rang for Cook. The magician came in. Cook is ill, he said. Who will get breakfast? asked King Rollo. I can't worry about breakfast. I'm off to get the doctor, said the magician. King Rollo got out of bed. He washed himself. Then he got dressed. King Rollo went downstairs and into the kitchen. First put on the kettle, said King Rollo to himself. He hummed a little tune. <laughs> now bread for the toast. <laughs> Oh dear, where are the eggs, he said, and I'll need the jam. Upstairs in bed, Cook opened her eyes. Oh dear, she said, as she heard the boiling kettle whistle. Oh dear, oh dear, she said, as she smelt the burning toast. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, she said, as she heard something fall. Then there was a knock on Cook's door. Come in, said Cook weakly. Slowly the door opened and King Rollo peeked in. It's about breakfast, he said. Oh dear, said Cook. I really can't make any today. No, I know, said King Rollo, and he opened the door wide. I've made some for you. Oh. You are kind, said Cook. It's years since I had breakfast in bed. She sat up and looked at the tray. That's far too much for me, she said. I know, said King Rollo. I brought mine up to have with you. <laughs> <laughs> 